everybody and welcome to this tutorial by CFM Studios. I know it's been a long time since we've had a tutorial, so um, I'm just going to make one now. Um, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to um, add gunfire and um, a flash and blood to a clip. Okay, so um, here, let me just import my clip. This is um, a clip from Mr. Incredible vs. Spider-Man 3. This is the raw clip from um, the fight scene where Chris shoots Alex or um, the other Spider-Man. Um, okay, uh, so let's just go to my desktop. Okay, um, it's in Vegas Projects. Let's just open this up. Fit a little bit up. Um, okay. Uh, it's being a little slow because of um, the Camtasia thing I have recording the screen. Okay, uh, that's why is that in there? I don't, why is that video there? That's stupid. Okay, um, yeah, sorry about that. It's gonna be a little slow. Um, there we go. Okay. Um, so it's down here. Okay. Now let's open that. Um. Okay. Now let's drag this into here. Okay. All right. Um. Okay, now let's import our muzzle flash or the gunfire flash. Um, I have action movie essentials um, for my flash and my the, the blood burst. Um, it's um, it's really good quality. Um, you can just get like the blood burst off the internet, like off Google. But um, um, action movie essentials is a uh, it's better quality and um, I don't know. That's what I'm. I use okay uh, muzzle flashes see um there's a lot of oh, here. there's a lot of stuff to choose from I'm just gonna use the first one just cuz um I just want to show you guys uh, come on uh, okay um it's just taking a little while. Oh, uh, there we go. And uh, open. Okay, there it is. Uh, then, then let's just you want you're gonna want to put that on top, on its own, on top of the clip, on its own track. As you can see, it has um, it has a black background and. We don't want that. Okay, so um, you want to go to chroma key. Oh, you want to click on that button on the clip. Okay, and uh, you want to select Sony chroma key. -er. Okay. Um, you're gonna you're gonna want to select the little eyedropper and uh, select the back the black background. And uh, as you can see, it's a little dirty. So here you can. Mess around with the whole low and high thresholds to uh, clean that up. Okay, so that's making it really like wow. Okay, uh, now let's bring up the low threshold. Let's bring it up a little more and then blur it a little. It's a little too blurry. There we go. Okay, and um. Now you're gonna want to find the exact moment that he fires. Oh wait, okay. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, see, and now uh, that's a little too big, and it's in the wrong spot. So you're just gonna want to click on Event Pan Crop. And uh, here, uh, make that 
a little smaller. Well, that's way too small. Okay, then I'm just moving around. Okay. Let's make it a little smaller. Okay, um, that looks good. Okay, so um, now you're going to want to import a sound effect for the gun. Um, Action Movie Essentials doesn't come with um, it doesn't come with a sound, so you can just go on the internet and download one. Okay, uh, it's in my documents. No wait, no, dang it, it's on the it's on the desktop. Never mind. Okay, okay um. Okay, um, now, I guess Pro Projects. Okay, uh, there we go. It's a gunfire sound. Okay, um, now you're gonna wanna put the, the exact moment, same moment it shoots. He shoots the gun, so okay here now to watch this. Okay, that looks good so far. Now we just need a blood burst. Coming out of uh, Alex's head. Okay, um Action Movie Essentials comes with some blood bursts. I'm just gonna use one of those. Uh this will ever open. Okay, um Okay, it's actually the essentials. Blood bursts. Okay, and I'm just gonna use the first one. Because, uh, you know, I'm just trying to show you guys. Okay, now, uh, once again, you're gonna wanna put it on its own track above everything. Okay, and uh, put it at the same time as the gunfire. Okay, and uh, just do the chroma keying thing again. And uh, to take out the black background. Okay, uh, select the eyedropper. Okay. And uh, it's a little dirty still, so you wanna. Okay. Okay, that looks good. Okay, uh, now you're gonna wanna select event pan crop again and uh just make it a little smaller and uh move it around. Let's make that a little smaller. Okay, that looks good. Alright, and um, alright, now let's watch this. Okay, and so now you have um, a professional looking um, gunfire scene. Alright, well, uh, thank you for watching this tutorial. Um, I hope you enjoyed Mr. Incredible vs. Spider Man uh, 3, and um, we're going to be making some new videos.